Welcome to another edition of Carbs and Reckless Eating, the only show where I sit in the car and BS while consuming carbs. Matt Zion here, going to be going alone and doing a Sonic review, brand new hot dog. Go ahead and check out our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there or going down in the description for the link. If you like Let's Plays combined with our personalities, that is a channel for you. So this is the Cheesy Bacon Footlong from Sonic. This is brand spanking new and they have uh, variations on it. I decided to just go the classic route. And uh, this is, wow, this thing is impressive looking. Look at that, that is, that's cool looking. And it's just literally like cheese, bacon, and your hot dog. You can add other things to it. They had like a customized menu. But uh, hey, let's try it out. I said this looks really good, and this is a pretty good value. I think this thing was like $4. I think it's pretty good. Let's try it out. Bacon's a little epic. It's uh, a little tough to chew through. It's not horrible though. I feel like it does kind of make the whole thing a little more, I think I was saying like epic. The hot dog tastes pretty good. Cheese is also good, and bun's good. There's nothing like super special about this other than the fact of how large this damn thing is. I'm eating a hot dog in the morning, so it's it's not like the best fit for me personally. Let's get one more bite. It is, it is pretty good, and I think for a value-wise, I think it's also good. It might be $5. But for a foot long hot dog, and especially out in this area, unless you're going to like Anaheim, I don't think you're gonna find too many places that sell foot long hot dogs. This is pretty damn good. Sonic never really lets down in any way for its food anyway. I don't think I've ever had any, anything from Sonic that's like super bad. I would rate this thing a four out of five. If I was in the mood for a hot dog and I did not want to make them myself, or like, well, I don't make them, but like Lori makes some because she makes awesome hot dogs. My mom makes awesome hot dogs. Basically, if I didn't want like a homemade hot dog, this would be the way I would go. I would totally get this again, but I'd have to be in the mood for a hot dog, which I'm usually not. I'm not really all that big on hot dogs. It's just an every once in a while thing. But as far as they're concerned, this is pretty damn good and I like it. I also like the variation they have on the menu. You can ask for anything you want on it, essentially. I think it's a pretty good deal. And uh, like I said, the bacon's a little thick. That's probably the major complaint that I have. It, it did, it kind of de detracted from it. Like I was through, the bun, cheese, and hot dog, no problem. But the bacon, it took me an extra couple bites to kind of get that down. So just a contrasting of styles, but it still tasted really good. And this is a brand new item that they have at Sonic. What are your thoughts on the cheesy bacon hot dog thingy-mabobber? Let me know down below, and we'll see you on the next episode.